Welcome, glad to have you back. Today we are going to have a look at Dice Kingdoms. So, what is Dice Kingdoms? Dice Kingdoms is a turn-based city builder strategy game where we gather our resources each turn by rolling dice and these dice are dependent on the different buildings we build. It very much feels like a board game. I have played the training sessions to be somewhat prepared to what to come. And without further ado, we're gonna immediately jump into a single player game against the AI and see what that goes about. It really seems to we also have a lobby here as you can on the right side. Due to this board game um, kind of feeling, seems to be a game that you usually want to build, uh, <laughs> to build, to play a multiplayer. So Dice Kingdoms is going to be released officially on the 3rd of April 2023, regarding just in case you watch this in 2025 or something. If yes, well, um, <laughs> Greet us from the future, right? Or to the future? Hmm, interesting. And with this, finally, welcome here on Just a Zack, where it's my mission to show you guys a hopefully interesting video game almost every day. So, finally, let's add, I, uh, let's add some AI, guys. Passions. Um, how about we fight against... Oh, man. I think the training session was against passion difficulty. I'm gonna go with the Burgui. Burgui, up. I no doubt that I mispronounced that at all. Oh, we can even change our look. Interesting. Let's go with this castle. And I think in the training I had the sand castle, but let's go with classic medieval European castle style for now and try to win against these three. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, three, three is fine. Let's not overdo it. I'm probably not as good as I think I am. So here we go. First off, this is our island. Everyone starts as an island and we can build our main building. And also a few, I think these are supposed to be cottages. So let's place, I think, I'm not sure. We start with three, all right. We also don't want to start them um, or build them immediately to each other because there's this disaster meter. I'm going to get to this in a second. And as always, of course, I'm going to give you guys my honest opinion, having played this game uh, at the end of the video. For now, I want to rotate. I'm not sure how much island management is important, but I'm going to place it. I have no idea where it's the best place for a farm here. Sure, why not? And also we have a dock, because why wouldn't we? Let's have it just here. Sure. There we go. And now it's harvest season. And this is how we gain our resources. And this kind of builds your kingdom game against our friends, usually, I suppose. So I have four dice. Where do these dice come from? And all these resources. How does it work? Well, uh, again, it's turn-based. We build our buildings. Our AI companions probably did the same. And everyone starts off the same. <clears throat> because we have our main building, our castle. And then we have three cottages. And for every building or every building that has essentially a villager, some population associated with that, and if we can feed our population, all of these buildings are going to give us one dice that we can roll at the end of a turn to gather a set of resources, um, well, depending on said dice. For example, you can see here, one, two, three, four, five, six sides on this castle die, so we can, for example, get two um, grain or one gold a sword, and we can actually gain one disaster um, skull, so to speak, but we are actually rolled to gain one grain and one hammer. A hammer is being used to clear the island, to build, to destroy, to repair our different buildings. Also, in this one, we actually rolled three wood. On this one, one wood and one stone. And on this one, we actually rolled a hammer, a skull, and a one piece of wood, which we gain these resources. We have a chance two times to reroll. Unfortunately, we don't have the option to reroll the ones that actually have a skull. So no chance to reroll the negative dice, but we could, for example, roll these three or just two of them or just one, and we have two times the chance. Um, frankly, I'm not quite sure what the best approach is here. I don't claim to be an expert. So I guess building resources are fine for the beginning. And also we have this, the farm that we build gives us immediately or every single turn for sure for certain one grain. They take a lot of space on our island, but uh, we need the food for our population. And one food guaranteed is not too shabby. And this is what happens on the right side. This is the disaster meter. I rolled one skull 
and we can see the more skulls we have because you can tell we can later on we were gonna uh, roll a lot of dice which the more dice we roll the more stuff we get the more we can advance and hopefully fight against our friends and enemies but of course the higher the disasters that can happen and the first one is kind of annoying because that is where I'm going to spawn some robbers and these robbers are going to steal either a grain a wood or a stone from us but at least it affects one other island so even though it kind of sucks to be us in this case one of our friends is going to suffer the same fate and i wouldn't be surprised if one of the other three also rule that so the robbers are gonna take the turn for example if we have two skulls a disease is being struck i think i'm actually not 100 sure we have to test this together if all of these things happen like turn after turn or, or or if only the highest happens so if we have two if only the the the, the disease strikes and not the rubber or both happening um i have to admit i haven't paid enough attention in the tutorial for that and this is why i why i said it earlier um the disease has touching buildings get sick for one turn so we kind of want to avoid having touching buildings if we can but yeah let's be ready i think i'm sure i have no idea what i'm doing so Let's just say I'm ready, I'll take some resources, can't be too shabby, right? I mean, we're just playing against normal AI, that has to work, right? So disaster's going to struck, I'm going to lose some resources. Apparently, the rubber stole from purple, stole one stone. My own rubber stole one stone from red. In ivory's rubber also stole, stole rum from this guy. Not sure. I think we should have lose, lost someone as well. Because it affects... Or maybe it always just affects another, one other island. It affects one other island. Is that just the main target? Or is the disaster... Maybe that's actually something we want to. Well, not necessarily the second one. It affects your island. Okay, I always thought it would hit me and someone else. So maybe that's a reason you want to try to either hit specific ones... So the left ones always affect your own island, but the right ones affect other islands. So, Satanism. Transforms one house into a sorcerer tower. Interesting. So, okay. That is very interesting. Also, look at this. The turn. Um, font here is very, very small compare, in comparison to this. The UI in general is kind of small. I wouldn't be surprised if you could change this in an options menu or so. I actually, for once, haven't really looked at it. No. There's nothing at game right now. Well, it's the official demo we are having a look at, so I think that's completely fine. So, let's see what we finally do on our first official turn of the, the setup. What do we want to have? We could build a dock, cost six wood to two, and we actually have a lot of wood, wow. So, and provides a eight sword ship. We can use these to attack our enemies. Because there's also attack phases. I'm not sure if that's a thing every single turn. I'm actually, I have no idea. I attacked once in the final combat last time. Maybe we actually want to have ships early on. So why would, do we want this? Of course, to attack our um, enemies, our friends, to slow them down, but also potentially to destroy them and win the game. Because there's, so far as I can tell, three win conditions. First off, a culture victory, where we need to have double the culture of the second player. Or military victory, where we just destroy everyone else. Or a wonder victory, which we need to build, which takes a lot of resources. Last time I actually managed to win with the culture victory because I just spammed a lot of these churches. Um, not even sure if that was supposed to be the thing for a wall to protect from invaders. Interesting. Um, not even sure how much that was supposed to be the way in the tutorial. Because we didn't even have all that many buildings. Like, I had, for example, no walls in the tutorial. Let's see how that's gonna work. So... Um, what do I want to do? I want to use as much as possible. Definitely one house, because this gives us some more building resources. We have five hammers. We can really make use of them. Unfortunately, this means we don't have enough for barracks and churches. So I guess one more cottage can't hurt right now. Sure. Two, uh, two wood, one hammer. This just takes one hammer, one wood. I think one more farm can't really be too bad. Maybe even a second one, you know what? Sure. Let's go full on wood and for now one more cottage. 
because at worst this is going to give us well a lot of food um, we can only have up to 15 food but um, even if not maybe we get some hammer some wood some stone or maybe uh, even enough disaster to hit the enemy with I don't know and we can build some walls I think I rather prefer to clear the area for, for now uh, one combat so okay combat apparently doesn't happen yet I guess we need to have a second ship for that to really raid Ooh, all right, we have one disaster one. It does affect another island, so frankly, I'm fine with that. We do gain two swords. Let's actually see. Soldiers are these. Can be sent... Um, soldiers can be sent on ship to attack other islands, to pillage buildings or even raise the castle. They can also remain and defend their castle. Well, defending probably doesn't sound too bad. So a lot of hammers are those. Wow. We would gain seven. We would gain also totally enough food which is fine the other resources sure let's go with that it doesn't seem too shabby right now let's get let's get disasters well we're gonna steal a resource is it going to steal from someone else or just do we gain that resource i think we did right well seems like s s quite some stuff was stolen from us as well maybe just a zack Stole from purple. <laughs> Everyone stole from purple, or even, you know, one of these disasters struck purple. Poor purple. Frankly, I'm fine with that. Uh, we are still. If this is ranked, I'm not even sure. We have the most villages, at least. Maybe it works like this. So I want to have one more house. You want to have a lot of stone, I think. I have no idea, guys. T just trying. Maybe one more farm. You really want to try to afford as much food as possible. Okay. This takes two stone, one wood. Well, one more, sure. Let's try to get as much as possible. Maybe one more cottage, sure. For now, we do have the space. I could build one more house. Or we just use this to maybe to clear the area. Also get stone, show run out combat. We do have two swords. Oh, we can actually target a building. With our two swords. No, I'm gonna save. Do I have to? Looks like I always have to... No, we can send a minimum of two. Or we just go with two. You know what? I'm gonna keep this. Because this helps us to defend ourselves, right? So let's just skip the turn for now. That should work. So if anyone decides to attack us... There we go. No, not to us. Okay. We have two swords to, t uh, to defend ourselves, which would be fine. There we go. They're sending them over, and looks like they're kind of lost. I think. Not quite sure how combat works yet. We have to target the building, and then something plays out. Okay, we have two disasters. I wonder if it's, it might actually be smart to just try to reroll and get one more disaster. To maybe, you know, get a lightning on someone else instead of getting disease. Because we don't really want to have at least touching buildings get sick for one turn. To have any building, you know, get sick for a turn and essentially be stunned for a turn, so to speak. Okay, three stone. One food, one stone. You know what? I'm going to rebuild these two. And let's just see wooden stone. I actually don't have that much wood in this turn. What do I do with gold, actually? Gold is a building material. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> so many... Gonna reroll this. We don't. I don't think we need that much stone. Let's reroll and see what happens. Two disasters. Of course, of course. Burns a building. Affects. Yeah, that is straight up. Burns some grass tiles. Affects one other island. I would really li like to have that somewhere else then. Oh no, that wasn't quite what I planned. It's always just one, right? Do we just reroll two? Let's reroll three. Come on, we just need one more, please. One disaster. Okay. Is this is this a good thing? Let's actually find out if all of these things happen or just one. Okay. Steel. Steel. steel purple. Okay. I sent some. Okay. It's, it seems to be always the biggest one. So we had something here. Is that purple? That's purple. Not sure if this came from us, but we struck something. I guess this. Seems like it also takes some space from the island that they essentially need to clear. Okay. Oh, we avoided disaster. A building being been uh, being burned down would have been not too nice, I like to think. Okay, we need gold. We seem to have somewhat of gold problem. We have 10 villages right now. I think I would like to have just churches right now. 
There we go. One church. Oh, I should have. Nope. Council. Don't want to have it there. Sorry that I did that. Maybe here. Two churches. Uh, maybe a little bit more food. We really don't want to lose this. Because you can tell too. Of course, we're going to waste 12. Every villager is going to take one food at the end of this round. And we really want to hit everything. Because, well, if we don't, um, the next turn, essentially one thing is randomly going to be blocked. And we don't want that, right? And church is a gun. I mean, could give us food and so on, but also uh, could get us closer to the culture victory. And if not, at least um, it um, prevents any, someone else from getting the culture victory. So, hmm, we still have five hammers, actually. I really, I'm not sure what and how to use the walls. So, for now, let's just use two hammers to clear this, and that's fine. Let's see, combat, I still don't want to waste three of my swords. I think, at least this is what I did in the tutorial, I only attacked when I had, I think, eight swords or so. So, I'm actually going to wait. Oh, here we can see what everyone else wait. Oh, purple already built a barrack, that's no good. The dog, yeah, maybe I really want this to be on the defensive side. Oh, no. Oh, did I, didn't I click it? I guess the AI is... Okay, combat is happening. Not to us, at least. Looks like here in the middle there's some combat. I'm fine with that. Here on my, you know, green island. You guys do what you want. You battle each other. Okay, three disaster. I think I'm fine with that. Just some lightning on someone else. We gain totally enough food, plus 14. Six that, two here, no sword. A little bit of culture, a lot of hammers. You know what? Sure, I'm gonna go with that. Gimme, gimme, gimme. 12 culture. Maybe culture is actually the one I want to go for. Okay, here's a 10. Everyone else is kind of trying the same. Lightning! Was that mine? No, we're hit a lightning at red this time. Okay. And another dock. The only way out of the island provides a 1 8 attack ship. Do I want to be. I really don't know. Let's have it. Might be smart. I'm just gonna build this. One more house because we legitimately just because we can. Oh, another one. Sure. Let's hope we really have enough. This is gonna roll. F nah, no. This does cost two stone. We're going to roll 14 die. What dies next turn? I keep forgetting what the plural is of dice. It's one die and multiple dice, right? What do I need for a barrack? Wood. I have surprisingly little wood. Yeah, because we need technically more cottages. I guess it just rolled in a way that I didn't get that. Barracks would give us more swords. Do I have a reason to clear this? We can gain specific resources. Maybe like this. Three more. Available. No, I'm gonna wait again. We have two ships. That has to be good for something, right? Combat happening. Well, sure, you guys fight. I'm waiting here with my three. Looks like they are um, not sure if they take resources or so. Again, I haven't 100% understood combat. Is he getting the bill? Oh, man, he did. Not bad, dude. Right. Bye-bye, Ivory. Ivory seems to be also second place. So if we want to attack someone, probably Ivory. Ah, uh, no. One burning uh, building would be burned. So much food. That's almost too much food. So we're gonna reroll one of those. 8, 12 plus 4, 2 stones. Nice. Okay, so we would now gain 13. Two hammers, one stone here. I'm gonna reroll this too. One gold. I'm fine with the gold actually. Do we need the three hammers? No, I think I have enough. Three hammers, this one too. Now uh, four. Well, as long as we don't get two disasters, removes 8%. Well, let's reroll. Let's see what happens. Oh, not a single disaster. Oh, I wanna, would really like to have the thunderstorm actually. Um, Don't wanna have any of my buildings be burned. I have so much food again. So this is fine. This is gonna be 15. And this one, too. Come on, just one disaster. Please. Ah! Lose a building. Well, that's the dice luck, right? Ah, what are we going to lose? 
A cottage. That's fine. That's fine. Ne we never needed that cottage anyway. These peasants, these dirty ones. <laughs> what do they think? Okay, we have 16. Ivory is kind of close. Definitely our biggest enemy right now. Are these his churches? He has three churches. He's going to overtake us eventually. Okay, I think we have to try to attack him then. Let's have some barracks then. At least one. Another dock. I, I'm really not sure what to do with all my ships. Well, let's get rid of this burned down cottage. We never needed that to begin with. Never like that cottage. I would like to have another barrack. For that, I need gold. What is going to generate gold? Not too much, actually. No. Maybe the house. Well, we have two, four, five houses. Six wood to stone. Provides a eight attack ship. That's the thing. How do I use my eight attack ship? Do I want to have another dock? Everyone has two. No, this one has three. Well, I have no idea. Research is not a thing. Let's just have one more because I can. Because I'm afraid. And because why not have a church too. There we go. A wall. We have one stone. No, okay. Let's end the turn. Combat. I have five swords right now. Do I want to use them? Oh, look at this. His food amount. Okay, let's go. Did I do it? Oh, yeah. Okay. Just raid them. Yeah, let's go. Attack, my people. Get down. A little bit less food. And we're gonna get out of here. Bye-bye. Okay, everyone else is ignoring me, thankfully. Okay, we have to slow him down as much as possible. Okay, that worked. Screw you, Ivory. I never liked you to begin with. Okay, two disaster. I would like to have one more. So we don't have enough food right now. We have yeah, a lot of those. Three stone. Three swords. I actually like that. Um, how about I, I reroll these two in hopes to get a little bit more food and this one too. We don't need that many. Let's reroll and see what we get from this. One disaster would be nice. Cool. That's some lightning. We still do not get enough food. That kind of sucks actually. The house is not going to provide any. So that's why we need more farms. Uh, we should have followed um, whatever Ivory did there. Uh, man, we would just try to roll the one to get the four food. I think that's not worth it, actually. Maybe this one, but the coin isn't too shabby either, I think. No, no. It's a disaster. Okay, let's just roll this question mark. I don't want to have another disaster. Burnt down building might be annoying. And we are gonna have two things that we can't Hey, that is annoying. That's uh, fine. I'll take it like this. Can't feed our people. Can't feed them. Disasters. Well, at least lightning is going to strike at someone else's door. There we go. Yeah, screw you, white. Ah, uh, screw you, red. Yeah, okay. Two of our buildings are now blocked because we don't have the food for that, unfortunately. The lightning essentially just... Um... Filled this area. This is fine. We have nine swords, which is hopefully a good thing. Okay, we want to have at least one more farm. Probably two, I guess. Again, I'm not sure what the best is. Maybe this is why we need walls, to have them more on the inside. Let's have two more farms and a barrack. Not enough storage to store food for everyone. Because we can have only up to 15 villagers. Not sure how we ever get to tier 2, frankly. Missing. It requires a functional university. Not available in demonstration. Got it. So, church 22 is to keep up. I mean, you're gonna be disabled this round anyway. I'm gonna burn you down. If you're not working for me, you're not working for anybody. Okay, let's have more Baron. Okay, it seems like our path, um, sorry, our path to victory this turn is going to, you know, yeah, one more cottage here. To be aggressive, combat eight. Let's actually destroy his dog legitimately. Go. 
Yeah. You too. Everyone, two of my ships, eight swords. Go. He builds a dock. We're gonna. Oh, yes! He's getting attacked from that player, too. Are we getting attacked? No. That's good. Okay, also. Oh, yes! Good job, good job. Oh, man. His villagers, and we're gonna go. Nice. I think you also get resources. Oh, no! My swords! No! Why did you not? It's fine. Retreat! Okay, we still have three swords. Nice. And, sorry, and we destroyed one of his docks and another farm. That's nice. And we gained seven swords now, yeah. Okay, aggressiveness it is. We still need a little bit more food, though. Which means we're going to re-roll these two. Oh, man. Even with seven cottages, we really need to get at least 17. Um, you have one food, at least. Two and a stone. We de don't need the stone. Wood, maybe? I mean, on these things, I can't. We don't need three stones here, either. I think I'd rather have gold. Or knowledge, you know? Let's see what happens. Two disasters. Well, one. Of course, that's annoying. We can still re-roll once. We still do not have enough food. I'm gonna re-roll you. You really gotta hope for food now. Sure, you too. Let's see. Well, and or at least one more disaster. One more disaster and one more food. Nice. That worked out beautifully. No disease for us. One thunder to purple, sure. No one against us. That is just beautiful to see. Okay, I'm not sure if we need that many houses anymore. We have five. So you're gonna go. Get rid of these destroyed buildings. I'm gonna burn you down. And I think I really want to have more barracks now. There we go. This one down. Combat. Oh, already started. Because we can't do anything more. That was the building phase. Got it. We are still um, close to ivory with these things. We have ten swords. He keeps rebuilding this thing. But I guess the best way would to either try to get down his churches or actually his dogs. Let's go 10 swords. What if we get attacked? Well, we have the most swords. At best, four swords. Maybe a smaller building. I mean, we can only send eight anyway, apparently. So, eight here. Oh, and two again. No, that's fine. I'm just going to send eight against this dog and keep two at home for now. Just in case anyone, anyone sends some over to us. No, that's not happening. Cool. So, no military for you, my friend. Oh, man. Oh, no, they can't really attack the dock properly. Let's hope it's still enough. Come on, mate. Swords. I'm losing people here. Fight! Fight for your lord. Oh, there's white. Ah, it didn't work. Ah, at least we heard the building. Ah, this could have gone better. Okay, we do get a lot of swords. Um, we do have 20 food. That's too much. That's actually too much. So I'm going to reroute these two. You will still have 15 food, and now we want to have swords. Right? Do we need that many hammers? What do we do with the, that many hammers? Let's reroute these two as well. Come on, let's see. Please not two disasters, at best one. I actually was hoping for at least one disaster. So I'm going to reroll you, my friend. And I'm going to re-roll... Who else am I going to re-roll? You. Come on, one disaster. Two and six chance. Ah, uh, yeah, I should have done it differently. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Disaster struck, a little bit of sickness. It's fine, that happens to the best of us. And Purple is going to send some lightning over to us. Oh, he's burning. Yes, that's what I like to see. We have 12 swords, though. Oh, yes. We are pretty much in the lead. Oh, Ivory is with 16 villagers. Oh, man, he really wants to get that victory, right? We have to destroy his churches. Does this have life points? Health 26, yeah. What's burning here? Disabled. I guess attack. let's attack his barracks and then one of his churches, maybe. And let's hope no one else is going to attack us. So six against... This barracks, no, eight against the barrack and four, actually four against this dog. Maybe that's enough. 
And again, we don't need that many houses, right? I'd rather have barracks at this stage. So I'm gonna burn you. Destroy you and build even more barracks. We have three dogs. We're gonna make the best out of that. Combat initiated. Okay, all eight against this barracks. So he can't really defend himself or defend himself for less. And four against this. Same as before. Let's hope that maybe this way. Can't really reach it, right? So I guess from here after all. Okay, let's go, my ships. Okay, White is attacking over there. Oh, and he gets attacked by purple. Are we attacking each other? No! Ah, oh, we are attacking each other. Dang it. Well, that's kind of a waste. Let's hope we can actually actually get down the dock. Oh, man. Well, <laughs> who would have thought? So much for that raid. <laughs> Everyone at White, but we got the dog. That's nice. Well, <laughs> not necessarily a coordinated strike there with the purple. But we got a dog. We got a dog. That's nice. Plus nine swords right now. We gained so many hammers. We don't need that many hammers. Not at all. 16 food. So we can actually use these two too. Let's hope not to roll any disaster right now. Let's see what happens. Well, even more food. It's fine. So I'm gonna keep this. We're going to steal one resource somewhere. No disaster for us. We have 10 swords. I still want more. More, more, more. I guess I just want to build more farms and then more barracks and then keep attacking. Ivory actually now has lead and knowledge. That's fine. We are the aggressor, apparently. It's not necessarily what I planned. I actually thought I was the one who would go for a, you know, nice victory of friendship and so on, but apparently not. Sure, let's go. And one more barrack from here. Not enough storage to store food for everyone, yeah. Do it anyways. Oh no, I wanted to cancel a building. I couldn't. One is gonna be deactivated then. Well, then it is how it is. Ah, you are annoying, White. What am I going to do against you? Do I destroy his dock again? Attack again when burned one wood this? I'm kind of afraid. He has six swords. So there's a good shit purple too. Gotta be per careful that purple is not going to fall into my back. But Ivory is right now the one in the lead. So again, sure. I'm just going to attack with eight. Um, he's coming, but he's not coming at us. No one is coming at us. That's fine. Okay, we're gonna take the dog down. You guys fight each other. That's fine. Thank you. That Very nice that the eye is more on our side here. <laughs> and very tame towards us. That's fine. Okay, got two buildings. And we lost, like, maybe one sword at best. That's fine. That was a good raid. He has so many here. Oh, man, purple is kinda... Oh, that's red. Kinda starting to scare me. Ah, uh, but they don't have that much wonder. Hmm. Okay, let's roll. Give me swords. Give me, give me, give me. Uh, two disaster. That's not nice. Oh, 11 swords. We need more food, though. We have a food problem. Of course we do. Gonna re-roll you two. I'm going to actually re-roll you two. Three stone. Maybe, maybe that's good. Maybe I re-roll you, actually. Ah, no, it's fine. Let's re-roll you and see what happens. Okay, a little bit food. We need one more, essentially. Not a disaster, though. Um, I would like to have a disaster, actually. And re-roll you three. Come on, give me something good. Papa needs one food, at least. And disaster. Ah, oh, no, two disasters. Some oh, no, burning is gonna... Uh, building is gonna be burned down. Great, that is not nice. It's a farm. Of course it is. Ah... And we got a lightning strike as well. And one building is probably apparently blocked. Can I see which one? This one, this cottage. Yeah, we have six hammers though. Okay, let's get rid of this. Rebuild it. Okay, have two more farms. There we go. We need food, food, food. So we don't necessarily need, need that many cottages anymore. I want to be the aggressor. Oh, man, he has so much. I also would really like to get the wonder victory, honestly, but it seems like we have to try and destroy... Burn this. Destroy white, if we can. Fucking ivory. 
I thought we would be friends, but apparently we won't be. Okay, combat. He keeps rebuilding these. That's annoying. Uh, this has also been repaired, so we are going to send in our units. Actually, here. Come on. Eight people. Here. Let's hope they really destroy at least three farms. Two, or at least two. And you guys. Ah, I would really want to get the churches. He has only four swords. So I have 12 available. I'm actually afraid that someone else is going to send people at him. I'm also kind of afraid that someone is going to send people at me. He can't really get this dog properly. You know what I want to find out? If I send eight over here... Can I re... Um, I'm actually not sure what this ship... Can I... Oh, look at this. Seems like I can't stop this command here. I am honestly not sure what this ship is gonna do. I think it's going to send land here and send eight people over there. Okay, so that's one thing I would like to see improved in the full game. <laughs> that, you know, um, you can redo one attack command at least. Because, well, let's see what happens. I'm gonna keep four swords at home. Is anyone going to attack me? Luckily, the game is very nice. Okay, they're going to send people. That's fine. Well, yeah, they just... Oh, great. Because this building has been destroyed and now they just land it and goes back. Great. Well, that sucks. That's why we need essentially more dogs. Ah, greed. That is not what I wanted at all. Well, we have a lot of swords. We have a lot of resource. We have so much food. Wow. I would like to have a little bit more disaster in this case. These guys? Sure. So much stone like this. Let's see. Only one disaster place. Yeah, of course we get two. Of course, this game is not our friend at all. Please, give me, give me, give me. That is going to be enough. Just one disaster. Come on. Of course, not a single one. Yeah, freaking burn down. I'll take it. Sure. Give me, give me, give me. Ah, that is honestly not nice. Okay, we have to get rid of ivory now. Just a sec. One losing food. A church is being burned down. Of course it is. Ha ha ha. Clear, clear. Oh, this is going to give us one disaster if we just get rid of one of those. Very interesting. That has a lot of potential to get certain disaster things going on or so. So I have 14 buildings. I'm gonna build one more dock. Really seems like that is what I'm gonna do now. Do I need a house or just church? Again, church is good against the other players. And we have to have this to compete with Ivory. One more farm, maybe? The more farms I have, the less cottages I need. What if I actually start building walls somehow? Where would anyone attack me? Maybe here, so. I have a wall there. Was that just going to take one? I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, yeah, just take one. Interesting. Maybe you can only have to a certain amount or so. Okay, um, here we go. You know what? Sure. I want you guys to attack that church. Eight people. Second one. Eight people over here. And also this church. Eight people over here. We have 31 swords. Oh, still seven swords. No, no, you know what? With these sevens, um, you guys are going to attack... Oh. Did I send them? I sent them. Whatever. Just go out. Oh, now the... Oh, with the red. Whatever. Go, my people! Take these churches! It's our god that is the only one that matters. We are the smartest, and they, we are going to prove that to the world by getting rid of our competitors. <laughs> We are here for victory. Okay, we got three churches. Oh, and look at that amount of farms that we got as well. Oh, that hurt. That hurt beautifully. And still a lot of our people managed to escape. Red also attacked. Oh, man. Thank you, Red. You are my friend indeed. Oh, what would this be? Removes 80% of swords. That would actually be very, very bad for us. I want to have one more. 
Because affects three other islands. Oh, Tornado destroys the building. We need that so badly. Oh, man, so many swords. If I reroll this. So we have enough food. And we could afford to lose three. That means I'm going to reroll re these three in hopes to actually get disaster going. Transfer one house into source of dry. I wonder what that is. Affects three other islands. Also sounds pretty good. All buildings get sick for one. Oh, um, that's awful. I wonder if I actually want to re-roll my swords. No, I don't. Probably don't. No, let's not get too greedy. Also this, let's see what happens first. Let's see what happens on this re-roll. One, ah, two disaster. Now I want to have one. Now I would like to have some Satanism going on. Steals 80%. Oh, pirates fix your island. I mean, a plague is not that bad, actually. All buildings get sick for one turn. I could deal with that. What if I re-roll you? Would I have enough? I actually would have enough. And I'm going to re -roll you. So it's a 2 in 6 chance to get one disaster. Do I want to re-roll one other? Yeah, yes. Either I get even more swords, or it's like a 3 in 6 chance to get a disaster, right? I'm gonna re-roll and hope I get one disaster. If not, plague would be fine, so pirates would suck. So uh, give me one, please. Ah, oh, yes, no, yes! Ah, oh, Sorcerer Tower! Let's see what Satanism is about. Oh, that sounds great. Whoa! You guys are all evil! Ah, oh, that has to be something good for us, right? Definitely, I mean, it's called a disaster. It has to be bad for them, then. Oh, let's see, I want to see. Oh, there's a... What is this? Sorcerer Tower, functional. Attacker gain when burned for gold. And three disaster, provides and dies. Oh, that's a lot of disaster. So they get this kind of dice, which is high risk, high reward. But that is something they have to deal with. And they lost a building. So if nothing else, they lost a building, right? Transforms one house. And that has to be something good. Purp oh, purple is on the rise. Oh, purple is on the rise so bad. But it's fine. If we can destroy white. We have pretty much won due to our superiority in knowledge. I actually want to have my walls now. I don't want to get attacked myself. That is essentially our goal right now. If we can defend ourselves. Oh, there we go. That's the amount of stone it takes. Hmm? I just want to protect myself. If we can manage that, everything else is not too shabby. Then we can finally marriage into a good household. I don't know. We can claim that we didn't suffer from Satanism. Ah, this is kind of a weak spot then. Ah, sure, let's get rid of this. Not that much disaster needed. Do I want to have another farm? Ah, maybe one more. Let's go with this. Okay, we have 39. Maybe I should have built another dock. I'm not even sure if I could have. And you know what? Sure, we're going to focus on the castle. Let's see if we can take it down. Eight people from here. The castle. Um, where's my other ship? Also the castle. Eight people from here. Again, the castle. Eight people from here. Sure, let's from these two. Let's go. Four ships. Thankfully, the AI really doesn't focus on us. It's far. So, sure, let's see how far we can come. Even if we don't destroy it, we are probably going to deal a lot of damage to the buildings. And I'm pretty much fine with that. Go, my people! 32 swords, destroy their castle! Clay, and prove the world that we are the smartest nation in all of Dice Kingdom world. Screw you, Ivory! I never liked you to begin with. Now we have the most knowledge. That should work, right? That's why you want to have walls to protect your castle. Wow. That was surprisingly easy to get done. So, do I have one, I guess, after this round eventually? That's a lot of disaster. I would like to have one more to get Satanism. Also, Tsunami sinks some coastal tiles into the oceans. Affects all other islands. That sounds amazing. Mitre, don't try this at home. <laughs> Fix your island. <laughs> okay, you know what? Sure. I think we have one now, because the Wonder Victories essentially need double the culture of purple. We have that easily. 
You know what I'm gonna do now? I want to figure out what happens if you have either the tsunami, I wanna see that, or the meteorite. And see what happens <laughs> if that hits our island. <laughs> I'm sure it can't be anything too bad, right? Let's go reroll everything. I still wanna have enough food. And go full on disaster. Let's see. Reroll. Would like to have the. Okay, we wanna have the tsunami now. Reroll, 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 reroll. Reroll. <laughs> Do we have disaster on our main die? We have. Also, reroll this. Reroll this. Okay, let's see. <laughs> it's probably gonna be the meteorite, because why not? Sure. No, not a single disaster. Oh, no, one. Exactly one disaster. Okay, come on. I want to see the tsunami going on. Tsunami! Oh, that's sure. Oh, sickness and thunder. And there's the tsunami. Yes. Okay, cool. They actually lost some space of the island. Yeah. Oh, and a farm. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Ivory has been defeated, right? Well, that it's blinking. Wonder Victor is coming, guys. I am smart of 100. Do you have sorcery towers in your villages? You lost a little bit of your island. I guess I really want to have maybe some walls to protect my castle if they're coming for me. If the AI would do like one last ditch event, you want to have that, right? Okay, let's go. Let's go. All the walls that are possible. Let's build them. You will never catch me. No idea how my people are traversing here. It does seem like, like a nice looking castle though. And we still have 35 swords, so... Anything else I want to build? I guess they could come in from here then. If at all. Oh. Quite mean to do it like this, but sure. Let's get one wood, because why not? Combat ready! So, now purple is my biggest adversary. 48 swords! Now I'm gonna keep everyone at home just to pro uh, to protect myself. 48! Well, he has sickness. It's pretty much his only way to attack me. Let's see, I'm gonna be ready. Is he going to attack? Oh, everyone is coming for me now. I mean, I'm a... <laughs> well, I have my swords at home, right? That has to be good for something, and we have some walls going on. Good thing I did that. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm the leading player, so of course they're attacking me. That worked pretty okay, actually, with the walls and my people at home. They lost so many swords. Wow. <laughs> you thought you could get me. Get the last of them. Good job, team. Victory! I am the smartest. I have the highest culture, as I have proven to my adversaries in fair, well, intellectual debate. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this has been Dice Kingdoms. I have to admit, I can see this game be a ton of fun, especially if you're playing this with and especially against friends. This has this, I feel like this has this perfect synergy uh, in between of being a board game, easy to learn, probably hard to master, but also for people who are not like into like deep complicated games, this is like right on the verge where you can, where you can learn a lot, but it's also easy for people to get into. And then you just, you know, get into Discord <laughs> like here and play a few rounds with friends and against friends. And have some random stuff going on, but also strategy and, of course, ally yourself against this one guy who won the last three rounds. And then you piss him off or her and then... <laughs> I don't know. I, th I feel like this is one of these games where you can really uh, have a cool time with your friends. But that is just my opinion. Having played Dice Kingdoms now... Um, pretty much uh, after the training and now with the single play, like one and a half sessions maybe... And of course, only against the AI. What do you think of Dice Kingdom? Please let me know. Um, that is always very intriguing for me to know. And I like to have some discussions going on. And um, also discussions in regards to my presentation. Please tell me what you like, what you did not like. Everything is highly appreciated. And consider sharing this video. And we're going to see each other right over there at the next video, right? Thanks so much for watching, truly. Stay awesome and bye-bye.